Hello viewers. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to write the self task to survey question and get a CLB 9 or 10. Before I get started, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and smash the like button. Also comment below. This way I'll be able to come up with more such videos in the future for you. All right, let's get started and see what do we have here. It's an air pollution control survey. You live in a city where the air pollution has crossed the safety limits. The local administration is planning to make air purifiers compulsory in all the buildings and has sent out an opinion survey to see what residents would like to say on this issue. Option A, air purifiers should be made compulsory for all the buildings. Option B, alternative action should be taken. So, I'm going to take option B because I feel that alternative action should be taken because just by providing air purifiers for just one building is not going to minimize or decrease the problem. All right, to get a CLB 9 or 10, I'm going to show you how to write an effective survey. It's actually like an essay, but you're not writing anything on discuss essays or agreement disagreement essay or an advantage disadvantage essay or somewhat like a problem solution essay or two part essay, but you're writing on the option B alternative action should be taken. So how to start your sentence creatively? You live in a city where the air pollution has crossed the safety limits. All right. All right. So let's start by saying the pollution or you can say the air pollution index as upsurged than in the past in the or in the city where I live in, in the city where I live in due to increased level of pollution caused by greenhouse gases. However, making just the air purifiers compulsory in a in all the buildings in all the buildings will not be a viable idea if the entire city is polluted. All right, the air pollution index has upsurged than, uh, sorry, in the city where I live. Because I was supposed to give in the past, so I've changed it to where I live. All right. The air pollution index has upsurged in the city where I live due to the increased the increased level of pollution caused by greenhouse gases. However, making just the air purifiers compulsory in all the buildings will not be a viable idea if the entire city is polluted. In my opinion, or I opine that that the local administration should find alternative solution to 
this issue by introducing more public transport facility in the city. So we have introduced the topic. So we can once again proofread whatever we have written. We have ample 26 to 27 minutes. The air pollution index has subsurged in the city where I live due to the increased level of pollution caused by greenhouse gases. However, making just the air purifiers compulsory in all the buildings will not be a viable idea if the entire city is polluted. I opine that the local administration should find alternative solution to this issue by introducing more public transport facility in the city. On the one hand, greater number of people opt for fossil fuel driven driven vehicles than electric vehicles for instance if the governments start giving huge subsidies to the buyers, then we will be more attracted towards purchasing electric cars or bikes than combustible vehicles, combustible or combustion run vehicles. All right. On the other hand, the pollution or on the other hand, the air pollution index will also come down if everyone starts putting an effort in curbing the curbing this menace okay so All right then. So even punctuation is very important. I always use uh, Microsoft Word. Of course, you don't have one um, in the real-time test, so you don't have to worry. You'll not be penalized though, but you have to make sure if at all needed, you have to also take care of your proofreading. While proofreading, you have to check for your um, grammar as well as your punctuation, which is very, very important. Like when you use the connectors, you have to use the uh, comma after every connector, like furthermore, for instance, on the one hand, on the other hand, et cetera, et cetera. All right. On the other hand, the air pollution index will also come down if everyone starts putting in, putting an effort in curbing this menace. All right. 
as a result people will live in a city with breathable air and become healthy by not inhaling fumes. Okay, we should also see that the 150 to 200 words limit is taken care with, otherwise you'll be penalized. So we have written 154 words. If you want, you can conclude by saying in conclusion or anything. But we have to see that we give at least enough points, at least two points, if you give, give more than two points, like three or four points and give one example, that is how you will get a CLB nine or 10. So if you write a survey question in this manner, I'm sure you will get a very good score of CLB nine or 10. In conclusion, I believe that option A, Option B will be appropriate, sorry. Appropriate. Okay, so you live in a city where the air pollution has crossed the safety limit. The local administration is planning to make air purifiers compulsory in all the buildings and has sent out an opinion survey to see what residents would like to say on this issue. In conclusion, option, I believe option that option B will be appropriate as as accommodating near air fury fires will not place in the building is not the permanent solution permanent action. Nevertheless, any decision taken by the local administration will be a welcome gesture according to the outcome of the survey. All right, let's do the proofreading again, which is very, very important. The air pollution index has upsurged in the city where I live due to the increased level of pollution caused by greenhouse gases. However, making just the Air purifiers compulsory in all the buildings will not be the viable idea if the entire city is polluted. I opine that the local administration should find alternative solution to this issue by introducing more public transport facility in the city. On the one hand, greater number of people opt for fossil fuel driven vehicles than electric vehicles. For instance, if the governments start giving huge subsidies to the buyers then they will be more attracted towards purchasing electric cars or bikes than combustion run vehicles. On the other hand, the air pollution index will also come down drastically, drastically if everyone starts putting in, putting an effort in curbing this menace. As a result, people will live in a city with breathable air and become healthy by not inhaling. Dangerous. Dangerous fumes, dangerous. Um, 
um, dangerous. What else can we write? Inhaling. Air. Yeah. We can stick to simple ones. As a result, people will live in a city with breathable air and become healthy by not inhaling bad. Mm. These are pollutants, right? Bad pollutants. All right. In conclusion, I believe that option B will be appropriate as accommodating near air purifiers in the building is not the permanent, not the permanent solution or action. We can say that. Solution or action. Okay, nevertheless, so that is Okay. Now, nevertheless, any decision taken by the local administration will be a welcome gesture according to the outcome of the survey. So I hope viewers, you enjoyed this video.